It's 1 p.m. here in Harare, Zimbabwe's capital. Welcome to ZTN News Blitz. A look at our top stories. Emergency meeting called over striking Zimbabwe doctors. Zimbabwe to grow first medical cannabis plant. Insights into Zim's grown all white party. And in sports, Nomen Mapeza's record stays intact. Zimbabwe's Health Service Board and striking doctors are meeting in the capital, Harare. The emergency meeting, which began at 12.30 p.m. local time, is expected to break the stalemate between government and the medical practitioners. The doctors want higher salaries and improved working conditions, and nurses have followed suit. ZTN is keeping tabs and will keep you updated. Still on doctors, the University of Zimbabwe Medical School yesterday reinstated surgeons Bothwell Mbuoyesango and David Shimoka. The two had been suspended for allegedly instigating the ongoing strike by junior doctors. But with all the twists to the matter, was there more to the suspensions than what the parties shared? Yes, we thought there was um, a, a breach related to how the the, the doctor was fulfilling his contractual obligations with the university. Both Mboye Sango and Shimoka declined speaking on camera. A new innovation, a new direction. Zimbabwe will today plant its first medicinal cannabis seed. The Zimbabwe Industrial Ex Hemp Trust is leading the project, which is expected to earn the country millions of United States dollars very significant in the, in the sense that it's not been easy to actually, you know, ever talk about the industrial hemp. We've spoken about marijuana for many years in this country, but industrial hemp is not supposed to be a new concept, but it is. And today marks the beginning, the opening of doors for every player, even people who are not thinking about perhaps growing industrial hemp as, um, you know, a sustainable crop. A bride asked her wedding pictures to be photoshopped after a guest turned up in what she termed an inappropriate dress. The photographer shows the guest sporting a figure-hugging frock as she poses with the bride. Well, so much for being dressed to kill. In sports, Zimbabwe PSL log leaders Caps United will not reach the record 78-point mark set by Norman Maspeza at FC Platinum in 2018 since the league expanded to 18 teams. Caps are five points clear at the top of the log with 47 points and can only reach a possible 74 points. Well, the Premier Soccer League Symposium underway in Victoria Falls changed football administration in Zimbabwe. The symposium has been well subscribed with most of the PSL teams sending in their representatives. The delegates from FIFA, World League Forum, La Liga Global Network, Swiss Football League have all arrived. We will be keeping tabs on that and give you the latest. Formula One has cancelled all activities at the Japanese Grand Prix on Saturday as Typhoon Hajibis approaches. Valerie Bottas was ahead of Lewis Hamilton for Team Mercedes in second practice, and those results could decide the greed if conditions are not suitable on Sunday. Australia's last Pool D match against Georgia at the 2019 Rugby World Cup in Japan is underway. The match is taking place at the Shizuka. Meanwhile, organisers of the World Cup have already cancelled two games, England versus France and New Zealand versus Italy, as Japan races for the Typhoon Hajibis. Now the weekend is here, but for some it could have started a bit earlier. Zimbabwean socialite Genius Kadungure celebrated his 35th birthday anniversary in the capital Harare on Thursday night with a lot of glitz and glamour. We'll leave you watching what transpired. Enjoy the weekend. <laughs>